PTRB has uh, uh, won uh, the presidential election in Lagos State, defeating uh, 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 the APC presidential candidate, Senator Bola Chidubu. Uh, Mr. LB scored 582,454 votes uh, to beat the former governor of Lagos State, who scored 572,606 uh, votes. Uh, I'll just take that again. Um, the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Mr. Peter Obi, has in fact won uh, the presidential election uh, in Lagos State, uh, you know, beating uh, uh, the uh, APC presidential candidate, uh, Senator Bola Chinubu, who himself is a former governor of Lagos State. Mr. Obi polled 582,454 votes uh, to, uh, uh, to win uh, that election in Lagos State. Uh, coming second was, of course, uh, the APC presidential candidate, uh, former Lagos State Governor Senator Bola Chidubu, who scored 572,606 votes. And the Lagos State um, you know, Collation Center was one that opened yesterday, so we had a number of local governments, uh, you know, um, wards, polling units that really came up with their results. And I believe today that the last two that were expected and that perhaps got us to this got, got, point was Ali Mosho and Ojo local government area. And, of course, now you have the full result on your screen. Uh, in third place, of course, was uh, uh, the PDP presidential candidate, uh, Alhaji Tikwa Bakar, who scored uh, 75,750 votes, uh, while Senator Rabiu Musa Kwankuso, the presidential candidate of the NNPP, scored 8,442 uh, votes. So the results of the presidential election in Lagos State are uh, there on your screen uh, uh, just out and uh, just now. Uh, General Ayola, my apologies uh, that I had to break into your thoughts and your conversation in order to relay that information, but it is, as we promised our viewers, as we get it, we'll give it to them. Uh, let, let me return to you, because, again, we're at the stage where everything now uh, is about post-results management uh, and about uh, managing the expectations. Uh, one of our guests did talk about our experience uh, of the elections in 2011, the 2011 general elections in Nigeria, where... You know, things went quite smoothly uh, in the pre-election stage. It went quite smoothly in the election stage. Uh, the election results were collated and announced. And then, you know, the bedlam ensued after the results were, uh, were announced. And uh, on that occasion, uh, we lost a couple of lives. So this time around, uh, to guard against this, uh, what you're saying earlier on about what we now need to do, and I know that in my previous conversations with you, you had talked about the fact that uh, security does not consist only of having boots on the ground. Uh, there is mind games, uh, there is psychology involved and all of that. So I want, I want you to apply that now to the situation we find ourselves. As more and more of the results become available, uh, people are, you know, with their calculators like GDA here with us, uh, you, know, are, you know, putting up the figures and all of that managing those expectations and ensuring that we don't have a situation where there's confrontation. Okay. Thank you very much. That's a very beautiful question. Uh, it, it is to be expected. Really, when the security is... No, we are taking this matter. I have already... I can't... I wouldn't cut. Where is the supervisor? I have already alerted... Look. We are so taking this into Ine. I don't think that we are agreeing. I don't think that we are agreeing. What I am telling you is that at Ella, we are not a lawless country. Of course. At least, just for somebody to exercise his franchise is an issue in Nigeria. Why? Why? What I'm saying is... If Hello, be 77. Obi, 78. 79. Obi, 80. Obi, 81. 81. Obi.